my name is Jenna Inglot and I'm here today to talk to you about my favorite backcountry camping gear. If you're a first timer and you're nervous about getting started doing a backcountry trip. So first and foremost, I think important to talk about is backpacks. This backpack is a 36 liter backpack. It's what I use for a weekend trip. This is a 60 to 75 liter pack. This is much larger, almost double the size. Always make sure my sleeping bag gets in there right away at the bottom. It's Again, it's more plush, it's a little lighter weight. Sleeping mattress, same thing. I guess my pillow can go in there too at this point. But now I'm about ha halfway full on my bag, so I wanna make sure I'm putting in the heavier items now. And this is a bit of Tetris, so it's how things fit. And um, you'll get, the first time you pack, it's not gonna be perfect and that's okay, you'll learn. This is my tent. Uh, it's pretty small and compact. I think that's one of the biggest things that makes people nervous about going into the backcountry is you probably have a tent that's kind of the size of all of this when it's packed up. You can get a base camp pillow, um, which just like your thermorest, you can blow up. Um, definitely a luxury, but it's really, really great to have. This is my sleeping bag. You don't have to go and buy the latest and greatest tech all the time. This one's about 10 years old. This is my sleeping mat. It's about an inch thick, um, but it's really great, um, really lightweight. A camping stove, not like your typical Coleman stove. This is a backpacking pot set for one or two people. Usually you're sharing gear in your backpacks with the people that you're going with. I always like to note, make sure you get a biodegradable camp soap. anything you're bringing with you into the backcountry, uh, the very most important thing is to remember that you have to bring out with you everything that you pack into the backcountry. Common misconception is that everything you eat on a backcountry trip has to come from some sort of uh, vacuum sealed or dried out uh, bag, which is not true. Oh, rolled oats are great for breakfast in the morning. Um, any sort of pastas are really lightweight and dry. You can bring all of that kind of stuff. Um, I push it a little bit on all my trips and I usually bring great bacon and eggs for the first morning. So these are two other essentials. One is some toilet paper. So when you're in the back country, you don't have access to a bathroom with toilet paper. Obviously, you're gonna wanna make sure that you dig a hole, you use the washroom, and then make sure it's buried and cleaned up. Bear spray, again, not relevant for all areas of Saskatchewan, um, but definitely when I'm traveling anywhere in the north, paddling or hiking, I always have a bear spray with me. In Saskatchewan, we are lucky to live in one of the most beautiful provinces in Canada. We have prairie and boreal forests and everything in between, and most beautiful lakes. It's really, really important that whether we're backcountry camping or front country camping, that respect for the land is our utmost priority. So anything, especially when you're in the backcountry, anything you pack in has to come out with you. 